the curse off and think of someone worse off. You can get in touch with what you really your feelings can reveal when you may not show it when you hurt deep inside when you're really frightened and you want to run and hide and your darkest fears have brought on silent tears here's the way to go when you Watching where we're going, kiddo, hey! Worries me not, faster, master, hey! Never mind scuff sacks, tummy, smelly socks and sardines, sandwiches, smelly sardines and socks and... Oh, I think I'm gonna be sick. Golf balls again, eh? No, I wasn't. It's the shortcut home. Rule number one, no shortcuts. Rule number two, no children under 12 without a parent. Rule number three. Oh. Uh. No bills allowed. Rule number three. Shouldn't that be rule number four? That's it. Four. We're supposed to say four.
This, my friends, is the road to success. We must practice until we are perfect. We've got to go. Please, Walt. No, 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 no. We sing it again and again and again until it is right. Now, understood? Now, you go first, Doris. Ready and... Beautiful. Now, Morris. Morris? Where's Morris gone? And Doris? Where is that Doris? Now, Bo Boris! Oh, you scoundrels. Um. Frere Jocker, Frere Jocker. Um, Frank and Jackie, Frank and Jackie. Bobby Sue and Billy, Bobby Sue. And... Bug stuffed in me. These young crabbers today, no respect they have for backsack feelings. Thank you very much, I don't think. so they can grow up to become ribbit, 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 frogs! Ribbit, 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 ribbit,
She'll forgive me. I know, I see, but it's different now. Your eyes are leaking, Kim. Do they hurt? I hit pass. She's my best friend. I hurt her, and deep down, I know I shouldn't have. Why did you hit your best friend? Because she was right. I am scared of putting my head under water. But you have water in your eyes right now. But that's different. Don't you ever get scared? Scared sometimes, Lotus? Scared? Afraid, trembly, panic-stricken, jumpy, jittery. It's like when you really know something won't hurt, but you just can't do it. But if it doesn't hurt anyone, and you want to, then you should at least try. Sometimes I wish there was somewhere I could go where I would never be scared. There is, Kim. Look. Kim. Everything all right, honey? Come here, come on. Remember when I'd come to sleep with you and Dad? That was when you were afraid of the dark. I'm not scared of that anymore, are you? Mm -hmm. No. Don't grown-ups ever get scared? You should have seen your father the day we got married. Shaking. Oh, now, I couldn't have been shaking because I was so frightened I couldn't move. And the day we first met you, were you scared too? No, we scared stiff. Both of us. We were frightened you wouldn't like us. Everyone gets scared, Kim. Doesn't matter how old you are. It just takes a little time. Like you being scared of the dark. But I'm not now. No, exactly. It doesn't it feel good not being scared of that anymore? Yeah. Hmm. You all right now? I think so. You think so? You don't know, sir. You think real hard. Are you all right now? You sure you're all right now? Are you positive you're all right now? Mm -hmm. <laughs> There's to be some bad things in the world, like it can't all be good things, like no tidal waves, no volcanoes. There's got to be some bad things in the world. Sometimes you get bad luck and you get good luck. It's just you're taking the chance so you don't know what's going to happen. If something bad happened to someone, it'd probably be just by chance. I reckon um, the world runs by chance. But I also think the world goes round like a clock because the world is always turning around and changing times and all of that kind of stuff. Some things are in order and some things are meant to happen, like things that happen in nature, like um, bears and that eating other animals, how trees grow and all wildlife and things growing in their cycles and 
it's what is meant to happen. It's what has been designed to happen. And I think that the creator, he makes the things happen. He makes the things happen that are supposed to happen. Can I just ask you something? Does anyone know who this creator is? I think the creator is exactly what we're calling him. He's the creator of the world and the universe and everybody that lives in it. No one can really tell whether there's a creator or not because no one's ever seen a creator. Is there something beyond what we see? I, I just think there must be. And if there wasn't a creator, there, there wouldn't be Earth, I mean. Um, how would the Earth be created? I mean, there must have been a creator to make it. It couldn't have been here through all time. But nobody really knows where the creator is. I don't know everything about the creator, but I think he can control what happens and everything happens for a purpose. No, because we control ourselves, not that little creator guy. We think we um, run ourselves. Look, I fell, o I fell over and that, and that wasn't for a purpose because I, I tripped over. Normally I just thought that the maker would just give us a brain and a body to look after and then if we didn't look after it would cause our own accident it wasn't him causing it. How do you know that they're accidents? They're for a reason. I just think there's a point to everything that happens. How come he would let dangerous liquids into the sea and nearly wipe out some species of seed birds and penguins and humpback whales and dolphins and all of those kinds of things. He just needs us to actually know there's a purpose for all, all this going on. Does anybody think that he's a she? I think he's both. She, he, he's both. How do you know? I don't. I mean, just because we believe in it, it doesn't mean that um, it's true, because we don't actually know. Sea floor, pirates' treasure, shipwrecks, octopuses' underpants. <laughs> Mind your step, please. I'm scared. Close the doors, Lotus. Don't worry, Kim. You're quite safe. You sure? Yeah. Just take a deep breath and try it. Go on. Remember, the longest journey starts with the first step. It's wet. But it's fun. Try again. Like this, better than that. It's indistinguishable, interchangeable, completely and absolutely comparable. I'll take your word for it.
Greetings, fellow thrill seekers. Greetings. <laughs> Why is a two footer not a frog footer? Red it. Red it. Wrong, Mocky. Where does our friend the frog come from? Precisely. I have observed that two footers are very interested in our frog friends. First, they study tadpoles. To do this, two footers use a special device called a white net. Then, they make objects in the image of frog. There's more. Two footers are trying to become frogs. But this will never happen. Because two footers haven't been tadpoles first. Cat after all. If you want to hear me back, that's okay. But I am sorry. I only did it because you were right. I felt bad when you made fun of me. I shouldn't have laughed at you. But you are a better swimmer than I am. No, I'm not. But I am a better skipper. Maybe, Maybe it doesn't, doesn't matter. Who matter. Best <laughs> it's your turn to look after the diamond because you are my best and fairest friend. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks, friend. <laughs> <laughs> 